Hi everybody, this is Dennis from the Dennis and Andy Show. I'm going to do my full review of Chariot, issue number five of the five issue miniseries from AWA and Upshot, Upshot Comic. Um, this is the finale, this is what we've been waiting for. Um, Brian Edward Hill, Priscilla Petrades. Um, this has been fun. We'll kind of pick up where we had left off. Um, commence rejuvenation process. Commencing now. Based on the estimate of your cellular de degeneration, the process will be painful. You always tell me that. Because it's true. Life is pain. Sister. So she's trying to rejuvenate. They wind up meeting, we'll call it on the digital battlefield maybe. Um, my mental space is my only place of peace and yet you find me here anyway. I'm not here for a war, I'm here to avoid one. We don't have to do this, Delilah. Why remember it like this, rotting and abandoned? Because it looks like this now. This is reality, you abandoned me. And it. I was at the bottom of the lake. I was alone and I got turned into this. This is all I want, your power, your freedom. I'm old, dying, you have immortality and you won't share it. If I knew how any of this works, I would give it to you. No, you wouldn't. Because you know what I would do with those who I'd give it to. Who owns you? Let me help you. You can't. While you slept in that car, the world changed. I'm just their weapon now. Who are they? You can't stop them. You're just a little girl trapped in a machine. And you're just an old woman being used for her anger, stealing children, fighting her own blood, punishing yourself for to be someone else's weapon. You forget your life, Jillian. We were always someone else's weapons. Wait, you're stalling. He's here, isn't he? He's close. Goodbye, Delilah. Remember that I tried keeping this from happening, and he's not close. He's here. And he comes crashing through the gate. My son is in there? Yes, Delilah lives. Then I'm going in. Don't. She knows. Let me help her. I. She basically says, I will go to him. I will help him. You take care of her. What do you want me to do? She has what you want, but you have what she wants. She wants me. She won't wait long. She comes crashing out in a cool looking, almost looks like a, you know, again, this story's kind of like Knight Rider. The, the motorcycle's kind of like Street Hawk, a little bit of Tron. But my son, follow her. This isn't safe until you finish her. Follow her. She goes and stays with her son, and he takes off. That is it. Again, this is just cool. I love this artwork. Um, can you stop her alone? What? I can feel him, your son. He's surrounded by machines. I'll keep him clear. But I have to know that you can do this alone. Well, she only has two wheels. She's on a motorcycle. That's not just a motorcycle. All of a sudden, the back tire kicks off. You see jets come out. And it's, like a, it's almost like a, a form of mech. She goes, Jillian, what in the world am I in? You're in a car, the soul of a woman bound to it against her sociopathic sister and technology that should not exist. And none of it matters, Jim. Stop her. Set yourself free. I will be with your son. The chariot is full of years. I'm giving you my body, Jim. <laughs> Just bring it back in one piece. So then the cool art. I, I really enjoy the, the artwork in this. He winds up clicking a button, launches a missile. She's got her own. Um, she kind of intercepts it with her, we'll call it a sword. Um, boom, he goes flipping over. That, it is just pretty cool. Your father will be here soon. You're dreaming, don't wake. So she sees her the, the son, he's in there hooked up to the machines. She's able to see what's going on and her sister stands over there with her lightsaber-like sword. Um, slam, he wakes up, realizes it, pushes on it. She puts it right into the middle of the chariot, goes right up, you know, um, the hood of the car. And he realizes, boop, going over a cliff. It's the only way. He's, he's just thinking about his son at this point. 
He goes crashing. She goes flying. She's a wreck. He's kind of injured. But she, Delilah's like, you'll never be free. Someone will always hunt you. Yeah. And with that, you can see it's a cool shift. She's younger like she was here. Now it's taking back over the nanites and everything. And she turns old again. And then she passes. At least we assume so. 12 hours later, he's they're, they're back at, uh, at the mother's house. He's going to be okay, Sadie. What Gillian did, uh, the machine her sister had, it actually cured him. You two are going to be, uh, what about you? Our son needs his father. Nah, he actually needs a home, and I'm dead. So she basically said I was dead. So again, here's the Michael Knight vibe. You know, he dies, everyone assumes he's dead, nobody's going to come after him, his son's going to be alone, mom will be able to take care of him until he goes. You're going to go somewhere with her, whatever she is, aren't you? We need to find out the people that Jillian's sister's working for, and anyone else who needs help. Jillian and I both owe the world, and we can do some good, Sadie. We can be good. You know, you don't have to do this, Jim. You can go home. I will. Not when you're trapped in the machine. You helped cure my son. I owe you that much. I searched my sister's files. She's getting orders out of Japan. Maybe we start there. Long drive. I'm sure we can make it. Some stops along the way. Get some people out of trouble. Who knows what we can do on our own. Tire squeal. Kind of like you, Jim, but you drive too slow. Vroom. That's better. Drive, Jim. Just keep driving. And that's the end. Uh... That was a heck of a good ending. Now at the end of this one, they've got a, J. Michael Straczynski's got a new one called Telepath that's coming out. So there's a little preview in it. Um, but yeah, that's the end of Chariot. Um, I really enjoyed the hell out of this book, honestly. I love the artwork. Like I have said all along, it's kind of an 80s. The Wraith meets Michael Knight meets The Matrix. Um, you know, it was consistent through the whole thing. The artwork was was great. The story was fun. Uh, there was nothing brand spanking new or nothing earth shattering in this that makes you go, "Wow, that's a first. But the way that they incorporated everything, Brian did a did a heck of a good job, and and I think it was aimed towards you know people my age that that kind of like those things from the eighties and nineties. Um, I am going to give Chariot a 9.2 overall. It ended well. I enjoyed it. Like I said, it's Knight Rider feel to it. Um, I just enjoyed this overall. You know, I hope you guys did too. Um, hit the like and subscribe button below. Um, let me know your comments. Did you like it? Did you not? Um, you know, love to have conversations with people. Uh, let me know your thoughts. And then uh, don't forget... We are doing the giveaway for the codes for um, for the Zero Point, the Batman Fortnite. Um, so leave a comment below if you want to be entered into the contest. So look forward to talking to you all. See you later.